depends. I can tell that we are gonna be friends. Um, well, I heard it was offered as an elective at Middleton High School, and I've always been interested in photography, so I thought it would be an interesting class to take. My favorite part about photography is probably after developing the film and making the print, um, making a mat and just like looking at the work and all the hard work that it's taken and entering it into shows because I feel really proud and accomplished. I originally got involved in photography freshman year because my sister had taken photography all through high school and it's literally all she ever talked about. She absolutely loved it. Uh, she had Miss Rothenberg and Miss Okleski and just absolutely couldn't get enough of photography. And so when it was time for me to pick my classes, I knew exactly what I wanted to do. And I took photo one freshman year, and then photo two sophomore year, and now I'm in photo three as a junior, and it is just the best class I have all day. I like photography because it gives me a chance to express myself without having to draw um, with pen and paper because I can't and so photography gives me that opportunity to be artistic and be creative without having to draw and it really helps me capture the moment of different times and periods where things are not necessarily completely clear but in the dark room for me it's all very clear. I got involved with computer graphics because I was looking for something where I could express my creativity and I was first coming to high school, I had all regular classes, I couldn't figure out what I wanted to do for my exploratory class, so I just decided I'd try something new and try computer graphics. I like the fact that it's different from all your other classes and you can express yourself and kind of do whatever you want and it's still high school class, so it's pretty cool how you can just come to a class and do that. I got involved with computer graphics because I was in a writing class and we were making a magazine, so we needed pictures to put in there to make it more visually appealing, and I came into a graphics class um, to find the pictures, and I thought it looked really interesting, so I decided to take the class, and uh, I fell in love with it, and it really found that I could express myself through what I was doing. I think if you're a person who likes to deal with visual things, it's important to have this type of class because it's a different aspect on the art world. I got involved in chorus as a freshman. Um, a lot of the older kids who went to my church and were in youth group with me did chorus and they loved Miss Graham and they loved traveling with the chorus and performing and wearing the sparkly dresses. So that got me really excited about it. Um, so I joined vocal ensemble as a freshman and then as a sophomore I tried out for City Lights and I've been in show choir ever since. Um, yeah, I mean, chorus is a... Uh, like, the thing about Midlothian is that we kind of defeat the status quo because uh, our football team is less than stellar, of course, uh, on, until this year, which is kind of odd. But um, chorus, it just it, my brother, he he was a senior when I was a freshman, so I just kind of got integrated into the whole arts department here at Midlothian, and I really, I, I honestly cannot uh, imagine any of a better high school career. I've met so many people, and. Uh, I can, if you're worried about playing sports and balancing that with an art, don't worry about it. I've wrestled all four years of high school. I've done theater with uh, show choir. It's, it's just, it's a, it's a great thing to get yourself involved with and it looks great on a college application as well.
Uh, the reason that I joined the chorus was I got invited uh, to do the school's acapella group by a junior when I was a freshman in marching band, and I loved that. So then, uh, for my sophomore year, I tried out for the school's uh, show choir, and I got in. And I absolutely loved it. I loved the people in there. I made so many friends. It's weird because when I was a freshman, you know, I didn't know anybody. I was real shy. But now I have a lot of confidence because once you sing and dance in front of all your classmates, you can basically do anything. <laughs> Starting in elementary school, I found my love of art and all of the art things we did ended up in a, a science museum, the Science Museum of Richmond. And then when I got, once I got into middle school, I went to a private school so we didn't have art classes so my mom had to give me, get me a private art tutor and then from there I just kind of expanded. <laughs> Definitely the getting the pieces done and like stepping back and looking at them all and just I finished it and I got it done. What's been your favorite moment at Arts? I guess working with the teachers here. I don't know, they're all really nice and they're kind of my friends, so. I got involved in art at a very young age, probably around two or three. Um, my mom gave me an easel and a bunch of paints. And I don't know, it just all kind of started there with me. I don't know, expressing myself, that's what it's always really been about, so. This ain't no place to fall I decided to take IV art because I created a studio for myself over the summer. And ever since then, I've been doing a lot of artwork, and I figured why not get the credit that I deserved that would, like, factor into my GPA and stuff if I was already doing the work. So I decided to do it, and it's been a challenge, but I really enjoy it. My favorite part about art is probably being able to express yourself and being able to transfer your feelings onto whatever material you're working with. school. I was kind of the kid that uh, wouldn't stop talking, so I figured, you know, a class that uh, you're supposed to talk in all the time uh, would suit me. And uh, it, it just became a lot of fun, um, regardless of if I knew anyone or, um, or uh, you know, what we were doing. The, the best thing was that it was always changing, so there was always something new to do. And, uh, and I really liked uh, being able to perform for people. It uh, became kind of like a thing for me, uh, so I decided to carry it into high school. Uh, my sister also took it her senior year um, while I was a freshman, so it was uh, really neat to be able to connect with her on that kind of level, because it's a lot more than just like a, a classroom where you sit down and write on a piece of paper. I took theater because I got introduced to it from my church group. There was a bunch of guys that were a lot older than me and they were just, they were awesome. They were like my idols and they were so outgoing and so like, I don't know, they, they were just people persons and I, I was not a people person and I was so shy and that's why I took theater. I wanted to break out of my bubble and it worked. Like. I was in, I just walked into theater the first day and I was very scared and the teachers, Ms. Ms. Bogger and Mr. Gallagher, they are so accepting and they scream at you the first day. It's so overwhelming and exciting and then you get to the point where you're going to scream back at them.
Uh, it's a really uh, invigorating experience. Uh, I find that um, that there's, uh, for me personally, there's like no bigger uh, adrenaline rush than uh, performing on stage in front of uh, you know hundreds of people. The best part is you don't have to even really think about that. So. Yeah, um, if people are ever nervous about performing in front of loads of people, the, the lights are down and it's just you on that stage and your uh, fellow actors, and it's a really cool experience. It's um, it's a real bonding experience as well. You really get to know everyone else um, in the cast and crew, and uh, it's just really interesting for me. I like to um, be able to put myself in someone else's shoes, um, and in theater you can literally do that. Uh, you know, it's not just looking from another person's perspective. It's uh, becoming that perspective, and um, I find that really interesting. Not that I don't enjoy being myself, it's not one of those kinds of deals, but um, it's just really interesting seeing things from a different point of view and a different time period uh, with a, a different set of um, ideals. Uh, so I just I really enjoy that. One day after school, we had the first day for stage crew. And my sister was involved with theater, so she's like, you better go to stage crew. And I had that one moment where I was like, do I go or do I not go? And I decided to go, and that's how it really started. I really like making this piece of art and seeing the end product and how it brightens up people's day. especially like freshman year, before you do band camp or like when you're going into high school and you haven't had any previous experience with like people, like for example, like for band camp, that's in August, that's before school starts and I already knew so many upperclassmen, like I wasn't nervous for my first day of school, you know, and like most kids are absolutely terrified going in not knowing a single person besides the new freshman in their grade. You know, like I just had so many upperclassmen that I could like look up to and they would help me through things like things that I was encountering like with my social life, with school and everything, people who had already been there. Like I had so much to work with and they really helped me be the person that I am today. Yeah, I think like everybody should definitely give it a chance because it's not like a regular class where you're just in a desk for like 90 minutes and then it's over and you're gone. You spend like so much time outside of school and you really form like friendships that last for a long time. Like, I, the friends that I made in ninth grade in band, I still have today. Uh, yeah, band uh, is definitely a great way to get involved at high school. You go in as a freshman and you're really worried about making friends and meeting new people, and band's just a great way to uh, go ahead and go to band camp, and then you come and do your first day and you see people in the hallways, and uh, you kind of feel awesome because no one else knows the people that you know. And uh, I know someone I always looked up to uh, freshman year was Garrett, and he's uh, someone who introduced me to a lot of the good friends that I have today. 